All right, guys, here we are, day 19. Today's a good day. Um, this morning, uh, got up and went to a Pioneer breakfast that our, our ward apparently does annually. I, I did not know this, but, um, you know, it's around Pioneer Day and stuff like that. This happens to be the weekend, uh, the Saturday that they could all do it. I'm outside. I don't know if you all could could hear the, the crickets chirping or the frogs, whatever. I don't know what all it is, but I thought it'd be kind of fun to come out here and kind of walk around a little bit. Um, but yeah, so the Pioneer Breakfast, they, they do, they throw out this, this huge breakfast. They do like pancakes and eggs and sausage and they even had cut watermelon, and they had hash browns, and they had the whole schmear. Um, so for breakfast, I had eggs and sausage. Um, it was really good. The sausage was amazing. The eggs were were re really good. They used, I believe, they used real eggs and not like the, uh, the egg substitute you buy at the store. Um, so for that you know the uh, you know what I'm talking about they used real eggs that's all I'm gonna say so um, came home and did a bunch of stuff around the house the kids helped immensely got the lawns mowed um, my my son did the front I did the back uh, and tell you what 11 o'clock it starts to get really hot, and that's when I started mowing, so, yeah, that was, that was fun. But it, uh, it paid off. The lawns look great. Um, did a lot of stuff inside the house. Laundry and, um, dishes and things like that. Again, the kids, kids did a lot of that work, which is great. I have some awesome, amazing kids. So, um... One of the things that we kind of pride ourselves on is our garden. I don't know. No, you can't see it. I'll have to do this during the day when you can actually see it. But um, our, uh, our squashes are they're just taking over the garden. Um, we have six tomato plants. Right? Now, I know tomatoes aren't necessarily ketogenic. And we can have them sparingly, like in salsa and stuff like that, uh, where you're not getting just tomatoes, you're getting also onion and pepper and things of that nature. Um, but we also do can, or I say we, um, very, very loosely because I have no, I, I don't, that's not me. <laughs> That's my wife and my mother-in-law. Um, they they make homemade salsa and homemade spaghetti sauce. Now the spaghetti sauce we use for like pizzas, we use for you know, pasta bar, uh, all that kind of stuff. And occasionally when we do pasta bar, of course I don't eat the pasta, but we have like zoodles or spaghetti squash or or whatever. And those of you who don't know what zoodles are, zoodles are zucchini you know, like, um, spiraled out or whatever you want to call it into noodles. So that, uh, they're actually pretty good. Um, and so I'll, I'll put a little bit of like marinara sauce, the homemade stuff that we make, just put a little bit on there and then do like a, a more Alfredo or cheese sauce. And so it makes like a, like a, a very creamy, marinara more marinara more alfredo than marinara obviously but it uh, it gives the it gives the flavor and i'm not using very much marinara sauce mm. since you know it's not necessarily the best choice for a ketogenic diet and it's hard because my my wife and mother-in-law they they make amazing spaghetti sauce it's really good um, and they also do homemade salsa, which is also amazing and 
definitely partake more of that. I want to make uh, avocado chips, and I am going to do that sometime. But you, pay, you essentially just take um, avocados and Parmesan cheese and just kind of mix it all together. La, 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 la. You know, I think in the recipe they put like some salt and pepper and oregano and other things. Anyway, and then you just kind of roll it out and sort of flatten it into these balls. You know, like how you would make a cookie, right? And then put them in the oven, except you space them out more than you would like a cookie because they flatten out when you bake it. And the Parmesan gets all crispy and stuff. And the avocado kind of helps as a binder and and still makes it sort of um, soft and chewy, I guess, if you will, or whatever. Anyway, they look amazing and would be excellent to to put like salsa on and stuff. So uh, maybe maybe one of these days I'll actually make those. Um, and we can experiment with that together. I really have to work on being able to edit and like take different videos and put it all onto one vlog. I don't know how to do that. I'm not tech savvy enough. I know it's done. I know it's probably fairly simple. I just don't know how to do it. So I really, I just, I just do the phone thing. All right, so um, back to today. Dinner, we had tilapia. I'm getting eaten by mosquitoes, you guys. Holy crap. Um, tilapia was amazing. Um, put it on a cookie sheet, uh, put some butter on it, some lemon pepper, some salt, and then put tin foil over top, and then just put it in the oven, 350. Cooks for, I don't know, 45 minutes or so. Anyway, it comes out, it's, it's moist, it's flaky, it's deliciousness, and, um, and then what do we add? Salad, fresh salad, and a bunch of different fixings. We, uh, you know, bean sprouts and um, zucchini from the garden, cucumber from the garden, green pepper from the garden. Um, and then, of course, my favorite dressing in the world, ranch. Delicious, love it. So that was dinner tonight, you guys. It was, it was, it was just awesome. Um, I neglected yesterday to tell you what we had for dinner yesterday, you know, which is one of the points of these vlogs. So we had breakfast for dinner. So we had, you know, eggs and sausage and stuff like that. And then wake up the next morning and have eggs and sausage. But it was good. It was a good mixture. I enjoyed it. Anyway, going on eight minutes now. Um, I was going to keep this shorter. I apologize. But um, thank you all. Love you so much. Looking forward to those comments. Let me know what you guys think. Um, and I will talk to you tomorrow. Tomorrow I will show you the garden for sure. Scouts on her, you know, Girl Scout, Boy Scout, everything, you know, whatever. But it's there. Did you see that mosquito? Oh, it's huge. Okay. Love you. We'll see you. Bye.